Uh, kia ora, I'm Steve Kartini. I'm from Richmond Primary School, Marainui in Napier, New Zealand, and I'm the DP. Um, kia ora, I'm Steve Kartini from Richmond Primary School, Marainui. We're a Desai 1A school in Napier. I'm the DP, Senior Syndicate Lead ICT, BP for our leader. Um, my, focus to, my focus today is on app smashing. This here is just one snapshot of a two-minute um, presentation that the kids to do of all the apps that they, that they actually inserted into the presentation. Um, I got the idea from Twitter. There was a whole heap of discussion on there and it left me thinking, sounds awesome, but where do I begin? Um, so I started at the um, top end of the SAMR model uh, in the redefined part. Um, the best definition I've heard um, for students from an iTunes U course actually, was redefinition as something that where the kids can actually share with the world and make a change. Um, the second focus um, was what does the thinking look like? Uh, I implemented the project through an authentic problem. We were given the, um, the we were given the opportunity to present at ULEARN 14 um, to share our 20 century, 21st century journey to the world. Um, the staff automatically turned to me as ICT leader and said, what could we do? I took it to the kids and said, okay guys, this is the brief, go forth and conquer. Uh, what were the biggest challenges? By golly, time. It was time, time, time. Uh, we squeezed every ounce of it out of our morning teas, uh, lunch times, after schools, before schools. I had kids coming to school before 8 o'clock just to work on it. Asking good questions was a massive problem. My guys were just not good at asking questions, so I had to do a workshop on that. The biggest hurdle was visual language. Um, teaching them the skills to convey feelings, movement, animations, um, filming, editing, there was a whole heap of things that we had to figure out. Um, what impact has the project had on my teaching? Hit hard puku, I call it, in Māori it's called wānanga. And it's when things line up and things started to make sense. And for me, it affirmed that Richmond's 21st century journey was evolving in the right direction. It affirmed within me that the learning environment and practice that we're putting into place was developing in the right direction. Um, has the project enhanced the learning process? Yes, collaboration. Tuakana Taina has been redefined on a massive level, not only just between our schools, but between other schools using the same tech. Um, there's a Māori um, proverb that goes, Ehara taku tōta tō takatahi ngārahe tōa takatini, which basically means that my, um, my prowess as a warrior doesn't come from myself, it just comes from the team, and that's one thing that we've really put in place here. Uh, what impact has this project had on the kids? One of the biggest things that we're focused on for our children at Richmond Primary is the ability for them to see their thinking. And um, for solo taxonomy and high order thinking maps, the kids can actually now reverse engineer what they what they want to present and go, oh, this is where it fits, compare, contrast, cause and effect. Uh, what message would I like to convey to the, my colleagues? I'm telling you it's going to it's not going to be easy. I'm telling you it's going to be worth it. MLP is the next step up from modern learning environments and it's getting that practice and it's not about beanbags, it's about the practice, team teaching. Um, my, this is just the, one of the, this is the actual, my, the link that I've given you is the actual um, presentation that the kids put together. And that's me, thank you.